This suit is designed to fit your specific dimensions exactly. Please review the fit and finish in the reflective surface nearby. Ooh. <laughs> Look at my arms, they're all f***ed up. <laughs> if you're done admiring yourself, I can show you some of the other functions of the suit. What's going on everyone? Back with another episode of Stuff and Things. I am in a pretty familiar place today with some familiar faces. Dude, so many people have been like, dude, where's Roger? When are you guys having a reunion? Like, we're a married couple. So you guys wanted to see Roger. I've been all by is. myself. You should cut to that. So I'm out in Vegas here with Dan as well. He's probably working upstairs or yeah, something. Like I said, I've been here for 48 hours, haven't picked up the camera once, I'm a bad vlogger, so I'm gonna give you guys an update from the last time I was here, like, feels like a year ago, <laughs> I don't know. This is complete now? Yeah, this whole workbench is complete. You guys may have seen the videos of us, like, sanding these and staining them and getting the initial stuff set up. Uh, photography studio, got lights and everything. It's pretty dope, it's visually appealing. Maybe not on my video right now, but when everything's set up, it's, it's dope. And now we're doing something that I've seen him use. I've used in the past, but I've never like had a friend who has one of these. This is like a rich kid thing. It is, it's 100%. Could like, you imagine growing up as a kid and having what we're about to play with? Because you like skateboard and stuff a lot, I think you'll be fine. But for me, the like, motion. there was times like, dude, I had to go lay down. Like seriously, yeah. I was like, Ugh. Check, check this out. Oh, dude, do you have the game where you f***ing like slash and shit? Here's a case. Put on the mask. This suit is designed to fit your specific dimensions exactly. Please review the fit and finish in the reflective surface nearby. <laughs> Look at my arms, dude, they're all f***ed up. If you're done admiring yourself, I can show you some of the other functions of the suit. Initiating rapid fire web. First mode. Hold your web shooter to shoot web bullets repeatedly. Uh, Try hitting that bottle. Pigeon. Yeah. Web grenade calibrated. You are doing fine. Fine? What the f? Initiating webnet mode. Use your webnet to repair cookies. I've disabled other webs for your convenience. Oh, that's trippy. <laughs> I got a f monkey bar this. <laughs> Dude, this is fucking wild. Uh, skipping them. Like I'm gangster. What up? Proceed to shoot, and here we go. Pistol handling. Deagle, bruh. I'm just gonna figure this out. I'm gonna do one of these. Boop. Who holds a gun like that? <laughs> oh. Whoops, I f***ing dropped it. Oh, this works too. <laughs> you got a two handed. <laughs> this is kind of intuitive, like, he's kind of do it. Got shotguns. Yeah, you gotta do like every little thing. What do we got here? Is this a uh, scar? Dog boots, put that on here. ACOG on here. Oh, and it's magnified, dude. That is nuts. It's a full auto? Yeah. Get some. Oh, yeah, way out there. See ya. Take my first time using a gun. <laughs> Just making that up. 
Че, так? Ой, я чисто блавал. Trying not to shoot my dudes. Hey, was this thing do? <laughs> Yo, so it's been like what three days since we started playing this, and this is all we, I've done. We. <laughs> okay, it's just me. I've been playing this since I put this headset on, and it's now three days later. We got some new games. I made a house in VR. I probably shouldn't buy one of these because I won't film anything just like I did this week and uh, I'll get nothing done. So one of the other reasons I came out here was to hang out with the homie Dan. Do you just like try to look murdery whenever I put the camera on you? Or... It was drinking coffee. It just it's, happens. It's early, you know what I mean? <laughs> so you guys may remember Dan from, what was it, NRA video, probably SHOT Show videos. He works with a bunch of different companies like Vertex and Zev. So that's why you guys see my bag addiction. He's the one who feeds it. I have such a bad addiction, actually. Let me show you guys what I did. Actually, I'll just show them yours. I had to go out and buy one of these because they're so hard to come by. This is my favorite Vertex pack, though. It's the EDC Ready Pack. I've done a video on this before. But it's in black multicam now. And you guys did like a limited run of those, right? Yeah, two limited runs of 300. Oh, there's only 300? Luckily, another friend of mine, Mike from Ventura Munitions, you guys probably have seen him on the channel before. He had like 75 of these in stock. He basically bought all of them. So I went down there and actually bought a bag, <laughs> which <laughs> I haven't done in a long time. I actually had to buy that one from Mike too, because I couldn't <laughs> even get one. So it's... So that is how they're difficult to get. Maybe by the time you're watching this, there might be some bags left at Ventura, so I can leave a link in the description, but I would guess that they're gonna be gone by the time this video hits the internet. Another thing that Dan and I did the other day that I did not film is we did a podcast together. So if you guys wanna check out that full thing, you can find a link in the description down below as well. So we also ended up going to a hockey game last night, like we always do. Check out this video of Dan real quick. <laughs> <laughs> Should I put it in? I'm not gonna put it in. If you follow me on Instagram, you might have seen what I was talking about. My stories. Oh man. The rest of the day though, we do have some cool stuff planned. We're gonna be working on kind of a new product that I, it's not even a new product. And see, I want this thing that Roger can make out of Kydex, so we'll show you that process. And then we're going for a helicopter ride, so. Should be a good time. All right, so we're out in the shop. I'm gonna show you guys what Roger made for me the other day, and we're gonna just improve on the initial design. So right here on my belt line, currently rocking the Travax Trek in this little sheath that Roger put together. This was our initial attempt at it, and I think we kind of killed it right from the start, but we're going to do it with some new Kydex, and I don't know what Roger's gonna do to change it, but. Uh, I think I'll bring the Kydex back a little further to get more of a retention point here. And then the new material that we just sourced, I think more goes with um, Travax's style. This is the uh, material right here. So it's Kydex, but it looks like leather. Yeah. Cowhide Kydex, I got it. Yours is black, obviously, because everything's a little bit of work. <laughs> <laughs> Whoopsie. So what I'm gonna do with this new sheath is I'm probably going to do a challenge that a friend of mine, Zach from Blade HQ did recently, and I'm going to try to EDC a fixed blade for a decent amount of time. I don't know when this is gonna start, probably once I get back home, if I had to guess, and I will give you guys a full update on that once the video is filmed. I would say it'll probably be like a month and a half until I actually go through using it all the time. I'm gonna film it every time I use the knife throughout that month or so, and it should be a pretty interesting experiment because that's something that I've never done before. If you have EDC to fix blade though, let me know your thoughts on that. All right, done in the shop for today. Here is version one of this little sheath that you guys already saw. Like I said, this one worked well. I've been carrying it for like three days like this and it was good, but version two now looks and feels a lot better. So Roger refined the design just a little bit. We're using the new Kydex that sort of looks like leather. Rawhide? Rawhide. Rawhide. Bigger, stronger, directional button clip jaw things on here. 
you just slip it under belt loops like this. Boom, just like that. It's on, you can put it wherever. I don't know why I'm showing you guys this, like this is a product that's coming to life because as of now, it's not. Please don't email Dez asking for one of these because they're not available. But yeah, just showing you guys what Roger does with Kydex and what's possible. So, retention's great, snaps into place. Did you tell him about what's gonna go in there? No. <laughs> no you, when you guys see what, what's coming for that sheath, it's dope. Yeah, there's something special other than just a standard Trayvax Trek like this going in here. So you guys will see that in the future. And yeah, there might be some cool new stuff coming down the pipeline, but it's all up in the air right now. Right, guys well hopefully you enjoyed that helicopter trip shout out to heli joe if you guys don't follow him or you don't remember him from a previous video i'll leave a link to his instagram down below he posts a lot of really cool pictures of all of the places that he flies so he took us up there maverick helicopters thanks again for the flight dude it was really cool from there we had dinner dropped roger off at the airport he's headed to california right now and it's just dan and i here in vegas both of us are flying out super early tomorrow morning so that's going to be the end of this trip for now Dan did just tell me something about a Vertex giveaway. Do you have the picture I can show? So as you are watching this video, if you're watching it as soon as it goes live, there will be a link to a giveaway that's going on in the description down below. There are a lot of companies that support me. I support them involved. We got Vertex bags, we got some Zev guns, some stuff from Defender Armor, TA targets, best targets around, hands down, and of course QVO. Who's the one in the middle? This black triangle. Black triangle, makes stabby things. So it starts tomorrow, the 15th, and goes through to December 1st. Okay. All right, everyone, that's it. I'm pretty wiped from this trip. Dude, imagine us doing this like two months from now, but harder for SHOT Show. <laughs> I don't think our livers are gonna be able to make it. We need a, a liquid IV sponsorship. Yeah, if anyone out there in the Vegas area works for one of those IV Johns, hit us up, because I could use some of that right now. We drink a lot of it. Or Liquid IV, if you want to uh, sponsor an episode, hit me up. That's it. If you guys are new to the channel, consider clicking subscribe. I make new videos every week. It's going to be all for today. Thanks for watching. Talk to you in the next one.